Oh my god, look at him. Oh my god. Oh, oh. How does that hat <laughs> stay on? Wee. Oh my god, it doesn't, it doesn't <laughs> even have physics or anything. It's like he's wearing a traffic coat. Oh god, it's, st it's super glued. <laughs> That's stupid. Happy February. <laughs> Merry February, everyone. Remember how to play the game? A little bit. Right. Okay, so we're after an emerald. We need keys for that. There's uh, Amy, I guess. This one? Yeah. Why? Why? Thank you. Alright. Look in the sky. Oh, it's that way. Ah, oh, see. How do I miss that? <laughs> I, I don't know. You're just blind. We're blind to the colour orange. Oh, oh. no. no see, apparently there's a few different Sonic costumes. We've got this. We've got a Rathalos from Monster Hunter, and we've got a feline, which is a cat from Monster Hunter, dressed as the dragon, the Rathalos from Monster yeah. Hunter. We'll try and show them off. You but... can't change them freely. We have to go back oh. to the. We have to exit the game to change oh. Sonic's clothes. That's stupid. Yep. <laughs> yep. Oh, just no, is. Oh no! I remember you doing this one. What do you mean? Oh no! I um I meant the light puzzle, but I'm not there yet. I don't remember me doing the light puzzle. What's so bad about it? It's just awkward. Uh, button. Oh, you oh. only have 33 seconds left. Oh, I'm so close. I never I wasn't going to make it. So close, you guys. Oh, the so flowers then, loaded in. Yeah. It's just beautiful flowers. I'm glad they're loaded. Right. Oh, let's go see uh, this bitch. Bitch. Bitch, yes. What are you doing again? Hold X. Hold X. It's been a hot minute. Yeah, not that one, Charlotte, the other thing. It's fine. Remember, if you don't know what something is, circle it. Yeah. Like Pokemon Ranger. Okay, we're not ready for it. Okay. So we need 24 more hearts. Okay. They're not really very interesting anyway. Most of these things, most of these cutscenes that you get with the characters with Sage, is just Sonic going, Huh! So tell me about Eggman! Huh! And she oh. says, No. <laughs> And that's it. And goodbye, Sonic. No. Hello. Okay. Hello. <laughs> that's it. It's every time. Epic dialogue. See, why don't you care about cutscenes in video games? I don't know. Maybe that. Maybe I play video games to play video games and not to watch a fucking movie. Oh my god! Are not ready. All right. Okay. I do remember this lock. I don't remember what happens to it. Yes, it's currently locked. That's what the voice told me. Voice tells you it's locked, pop up tells you it's locked, tutorial pump prompt comes up and says press A <laughs> to confirm that it's locked. Sonic says, huh, guess that thing's locked, better come back later. No way. Next cutscene starts, Amy says, Sonic, you better not be using that locked shit again. <laughs> I don't have enough Corrux for him. Not Corrux. Corrux? <laughs> Getting them completely mixed up now. Well, speaking of Corrux, Breath of the Wild 2. It's not Breath oh. of the Wild 2, it's Tears of the Kingdom. It made me sad. I don't want to play it anymore. I don't even, I don't Every want... trailer's made me like the look of this game less. I don't want to play um, The Legend of Zelda Nuts and Bolts, I just don't. No, I don't know who thought that was a good idea. I don't want it at all. And I keep I keep hearing this defence about it. And it's, it's a really flimsy, shitty defence, which, like, maybe it's true. But the fact is, the game's not out for months yet, and nobody's played it who's saying this. Mm. Everyone keeps saying, It's totally optional anyway. You can beat the whole game without ever building a vehicle. It's like, how do you know? Yeah, how do you know? How much gameplay footage why have you did, seen? If that's true, why did they put in a vehicle building mechanic into Zelda if there isn't a single reason to use it? Of course there's a reason to yeah. use it. I don't want to play it. Like... It, like, the first trailer where they just showed Ganon, like, screaming and his neck breaking and he's this shriveled dead corpse, I was yeah. like, fuck yeah. It was like, hell yeah, I'm ready for this. Now, Link's got a robot arm, like, um, like Finn. He's, he's crafting cars like Banjo. And, like, the, I've heard the retrospective of, what the fuck's it called? Banjo? Banjo 3. Nuts and bolts. It was originally Banjo 3. It got too big, the levels got so big that it became a pain to navigate, and the developers said, what if we made cars? And they ended up enjoying the cars more than the game, and then they made the game about building cars. And I just see it happening again. But this time with Zelda. 
I don't care about that. I didn't even use the horse in Zelda. It sucked. I, like, they couldn't get a horse feeling good to play with. And it's probably the best horse I've used in a game. And that was the only mount you had, and they spent years developing it. I don't think that they've got the capability to make a bunch of cars that I make out of... I can... I make... Like, I, yeah, I, you... imagine I make a 50-foot flying dick. There's no way it controls good. And there's, it's totally going to be mandatory. At some point, you're going to have to make a car. Well, if it's not mandatory, why did they spend six years making that? I yeah. don't want it. <laughs> like, it's gone from a day one pre-order game to both of us just sort of going, oh, let's uh, <laughs> get that second hand on sale. Yeah. Maybe. Let's get that after people have tried it and they're just like, huh, guys, this game's bad. It's like, nah, really? Really? Banjo Kazooie Nuts and Bolts was bad? Really? The game's only fun when you build the flying phallus once and then when you try and play it on your own, it sucks? Really? What? I played the fucking hours of that game. It sucks on your own. Yeah. And it's only barely fun with friends because what isn't fun with friends, right? Yeah, like when when you're building something unique and your friend's just like, oh, make it a penis. Like, I'm sure this thing will be fun in Zelda, right? Like, what isn't fun about building and flying a giant cock in Zelda? Yeah. But I don't want to do it. That's not why I'm spending 60 fucking quid on the game. So I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> Because remember guys, that's an option. You can just not buy the things you don't like. Lots of people do. Yeah, you don't have to fear missing out when it's pretty obvious you're not missing out on much. Do you ever worry... I, I sometimes worry about seeming like a hypocrite because we were both very against Pokemon. And Legends Arceus, we were both like, I don't know, it looks shit, but we played it and it was fun. Yeah. And then we both decided, oh, we're not getting the new Pokemon, Scarlet and Violet. So we were like, that looks bad. But Charlotte happened to win a Twitter giveaway and yeah. got it for free, so uh, but we then got to it play was... it, and it was terrible. Yeah, it was It was bad. If I bought it, I would have got my money back. It was that bad. That bad. By the way, we made a video of it. Oh, we can find <laughs> fucking Christmas outfits. <laughs> I forgot about that. I know I was looking at it the whole time, but... Yeah, but it just it refreshed it for me, you know, <laughs> just seeing it up close. Because um, these are vault keys. I think I should do it again. No. No, okay. <laughs> Definitely not, no. Understood. Right, let's, let's go see what Amy's up to. Not much. She'll probably tell you about those little rock things. Yeah. Oh, it's so sad the way that it's sad. Oh. It's so sad the way they die and Charlotte skipped the cutscene that time. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't even see that on my game. It's just this complete mystery to you. They just died. They all dropped dead and their souls left their bodies and they flew up into the sky and then these two cartoon characters looked real sad. Oh, bless. It was very beautiful, and uh, it's the reason video games are art. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Amy, do you know that you're art? What? I love how whenever it's you press A, the, camera, the, ca the characters noise. flicker to their zero position, so you see one frame of them being loaded where they shouldn't every time. Just do that! It happened again! Just do it when the screen's off. That's what every other game does. You load that shit in the background. You smoke and mirrors that shit. Here's why it bugs me. Mm -hmm. Do you remember on the Game Grumps back when we used to watch them and they played Sonic Boom? Yeah. And their editor Barry stopped to be like, look at this, between every camera transition, they all T-pose over here. Yes. It's that again. It's that still. And it happens in Sonic still. It's like 10 years later. And like everyone who watched it was like clapping and squealing, like, yo, that's so shit! And now it's yeah. like everyone's praising this about being the next coming of you know Sonic Jesus. And it's like <laughs> No, dude. <laughs> Sonic Jesus. You can't even run on water on this game. You couldn't advance. That's why Sonic Advance is the best. Yeah. Fight me. <laughs> like if Sonic's that fat. I love making Sonic run on water. We made a little uh, me and my brother made a little game jam game. It's just a game you make in a weekend for practice. Yeah. We did it back when Flappy Bird was a thing. The developer of that got like basically bullied off the app store. Everyone was like, this game's shit and I could have done it. And he started sending him death threats because he made a game. Yeah, but then He was, was a nice guy from what I heard. But... There was also a lot of like, this game's too addictive. Is this bad? Which was one of the reasons he pulled it from the app Mostly store. Mostly it was everyone being a cunt. Yeah. And most of the people who were cunts were game developers. So lots of game developers who weren't cunts were like, I'm going to make a Flappy Bird clone. 
Yeah, just like, I'm I'm gonna do this. Yeah, me and my brother did it, so maybe it wasn't everyone who was in the cabin saving the birth. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we made one. We made one called Velocity Wings, and we kind of stole the name from the song we used, and we feel bad about that now, so, like, sorry, guy. The, the guy, there's a story behind that. We called it Velocity Wings, because the music we wanted to use was called Velocity yeah. Wings, and we were like, we've made a Flappy Bird Sonic clone, like... That's the perfect name for it, right? Yeah. It's... So we used it, and we used the name. We didn't think anything of it. The weekend project. And then we got a message from the guy saying, like, hey, it's cool. You can use the name and stuff. But if this game takes off, I can't sell this song to anyone anymore because it's the loss of the Yeah. Song. And we were like, shit, we didn't even consider that. But lesson learned, right? Oh, send it that way. Okay. Lesson learned. Don't steal musicians' titles for your own work. Yeah. Didn't even think about it like that. He was dead right. We learned our lesson right away. Yeah, it's like naming... Never happened again. Naming things is hard. Naming things is hard, and we had a weekend to do it, and we didn't think anyone would give a shit. We thought, if anything, it would just make the branding stronger, which I guess it does, but his point was there wasn't branding to begin with. And they agreed to, and it's like, yeah, of course, man. We shouldn't have done it. Yeah. And that's why, you know, we told him we'd change it, and he said it's fine. So, you know, it's his fault. <laughs> <laughs> I learned a lesson. I yeah. can't I can't be mad at that. But yeah. I'm also not gonna I'm not gonna like not pretend it didn't happen and not talk about it. That's what most people do with these things. Oh. I don't even know where this well, is. I, I don't think I ever saw the green goo. No, I Hold the run button. Oh, sorry. <laughs> it's it's, it's telling you what to <laughs> do on the screen. Oh, it's this. What, why is that big eleven flashing? Oh, do I have skills I could buy, I guess? We turned that off. Oh. Then I don't know why it's flashing. I hate notifications, like... That! Yeah. I turn them off for default. Yeah, just like, me, look at me, look at what I'm doing. In case anyone ever tries to send me a message who knows me, all my phone notifications are off. All of them. I don't get my phone notifications until I'm ready to get them, sorry. You won't reach me in, em in an emergency unless you phone me. And I probably won't answer if you phone me because I just don't want to. This is true, I can vouch for this. <laughs> <laughs> if you call oh. me, I know it's something I know I should answer because it's like Charlotte doesn't call either. Yeah. <laughs> I answer when you call. Oh no. I answer when my mum calls as well, but most other people I'm like, eh, maybe not today. I'm not feeling it. Well, I once heard Stephen Fry talk about phones and why he thought they were very rude, and I couldn't not agree with it. He said it's the equivalent of someone coming into your house and banging pots and pans and making loud noises and going, Speak to me now! Speak to me now! <laughs> until you speak to them. And if you don't do it, they do it again. Yeah. And when I heard that, I was like, Well, how can you argue for that? I didn't like him anyway, but how can you argue against that? Yeah, it's like, the phones are useful, but it's like... They are rude. Yeah, they're, they're, they're very rude. Checking down map, where's the emerald at? Right, emerald time. Oh, we need ten. Oh! Or does that mean we need ten more? I feel like that means we need ten more, because... Why doesn't it just give us a fucking number? Just say, like, you have one out of eleven. The access requirement, ten plus. We... It says we have ten up there. Yeah. But didn't our thing at the bottom say we have 11? So that's something else. Yeah, okay. Is that... Yeah, that... But we turned that off! We turned this off, right. So where are we going? Uh, we can either get hearts to go talk to Sage, or we can go collect more uh, vault keys. I was hoping to tell me how many I needed for a... Yeah, I think it was like 22. Yeah, well, I was hoping to tell me how many... Yeah. Need now, cause, like, there's another one here, and I don't know what the number is for that one. This is kind of the thing that I hate about open world games, is that they're kind of not very replayable. It's like, once you've explored the place, you've explored the place. <laughs> once you've had fun exploring it, you've explored it, there's nothing to do. And that's why I think this game should really let you just run up all the walls and shit, and just go fucking crazy. It seems like you're not going to be able to ever control supersonic and level, which is what I thought the game was going to be like, but it's not. Oh, that's a shame. The supersonic stress was restricted to bosses still, it's just, there's more bosses. Yeah, isn't that fun? Oh, God, Ooh, yeah. I haven't seen a part where you can go underwater. 
Oh, hey guys, don't drown. What do you think he does? Oh, well, let's find out. You could have at least made an animation for that. I'm waiting! Wow. Vibrating. That was worse than Mario 64's yeah. drown. Mario 64 had a great <laughs> drown animation. Oh, it was so good it actually made some kids cry. It scares people, because it should be scary. 